e Mario time. Go blubbering is blobbing it up. Let me know if it's a little too loud. Hey, Steel Shin. Hey, Uina. Hey, everybody from Steel Shin Stream. I am Ixied Edge. I am a seal. And today, I am playing the Sega Genesis Mega Man The Wily Wars. Uh, I'm just finishing up the game basically the only thing I have left to do in this game is to do the Wily Tower let me fix the controls but yeah I, I've done the first three games already in separate streams and then Here's the the exclusive part of the game. The way Wily Tower works is you get to pick which boss you want to start with, and then I believe... Since we're going to start with Buster Rod G, the monkey looking guy, uh, yeah, you get to actually pick weapon loadouts from the three games. So... As soon as I figure out how to do it. So we want the uh, hyper bomb, the I believe hard knuckle, the crash bomber. Thunderbeam, because you can't turn away overpowered weapon. Uh, you should never turn away the overpowered weapons. Uh, air shooter. Firestorm and Quick Boomerang. And then items, you want the Magnet Beam, uh, item 3, and I believe the Rush Jet in this is the Rush Jet from 2. Uh, this is the arcade port of the first three games with the added Wily Tower. So you basically for the Sega Genesis Mega Drive you would get the first three Mega Man games bundled on one cartridge plus this uh, this fourth exclusive uh, 
power mode. But the game is just a, a better looking Mega Man, essentially. And I, I, I already forgot that I cannot charge because of the first three games, and you, you don't learn how to charge your weapon until the fourth game. But this is all new to me, I've never actually done the Buster Tower. Or the Wily Tower. I might jump. Controls are a little... They're a little stiff. But this is coming from the guy that just played like five Game Boy games. So I'm not used to playing a console game yet. Like the console version yet. But this game suffer it, it isn't as great for uh unfortunately the European <laughs> the the European audience had the 50 Hertz version and it was it was just this game was just god awful slow. Okay, uh let's Start with this weapon. Because I can shoot diagonal. Without putting myself in danger. I think I'd be an expert at this game, but not quite. Go get the slide though, so that's, that's good. This did come out in America, but it only... It only came out... Uh... It only came out on the Sega channel. Alright, I'm not... Timing my jumps here. The downside to this game is basically, unlike the NES versions, you can only shoot three pellets on the screen. Brought the crash bomb. My mortal enemy, the flame cup head guys.
gonna say, they're pretty... pretty generous with everything so far. It's the monkey! It wasn't too, uh, it wasn't too hard. <laughs> yeah, this, this game has some downsides, but it has upsides to it as well. Yes, oh, the, the game with the dinosaurs. I was told this is really short, too, so... If it's, like, really, really short, then I'll just move on to the next Mega Man game. We'll just keep playing Mega Mans until I run out of Mega Mans. <laughs> like, that'll ever happen, right? Gotta... gotta abuse... The best weapon in the game, alright? I can't forget that. Oh, I want that. like I'm trying to puke. Like about the metal blades is that they can shoot in like eight directions. I think the survival one is like uh it's like an updated like patch of the game. Forgot I can't switch Let's just keep the ant. Did they really give me... I thought they gave me like four E-Tanks. I was like, what? Why didn't they give me four E-Tanks? Can I... No. So, the ant one is probably this one. I actually remember getting this far as a kid, but I don't... I don't remember if I did the third stage. Uh... No, I don't have any... Well, do I? No, I don't. I had to think about that. Uh. I'll 
don't think about it. I unfortunately do not have any Mountain Dew, sadly. Sadly, I don't have any Mountain Dew. It's all Pepsi. Because nobody, nobody found me any Mountain Dew to drink. But I will get a drink here in a minute. Yeah, my, my zero, my zero sugar Pepsi that my dad thought was a blue label, but it was clearly, it was clearly black. <laughs> and it says, it says, it says no sugar on the box. But he's like, it's a dark blue can, and I'm like, well, I must be colorblind because, uh, that can looks pretty black to me. I didn't think that'd hit him, but I tried. That hurting him at all? What's these canners? This is like... This is kind of like... Either I've become like a hardcore Mega Man player or like these are some like pretty pretty poopy patterns. I win. Can't be either. I wear glasses. I'm blind if I don't wear my glasses. I'm basically like Velma from Scooby Doo. Here, my hydrate is done. I took a sip of the Pepsi Zero that I have just acquired the taste for. The Hyperstorm H guy that looks like a giant pig. of them to refill my equipment. Uh, give me my metal blades. I wonder why, like, the metal blades aren't, like, limited. Get out of here. I... I didn't jump. The pain. I wanted to jump, but it didn't let me jump. It reminds me of when I played Mega Man 2 on this, and there was like the part before the the dragon. It was just, it was very brutal for me in terms of like, oh thanks for giving me back the life I lost. It was like very brutal with like how it wanted me to progress with the uh the item ability. Like that, I literally am trying to jump, but sometimes my jump doesn't get picked up. Uh.
like damn it, like I'm I me jump. Me jump. Some good themes though. Mega booty. Can I like cheat this guy? I can. I wish I had, I had, I wish I had Corona's, like, god gamer skills. Where she can play with, like, extreme input lag. <laughs> Ooh. You... How the hell do you have two health bars? Hyperbomb. <laughs> this is this is all I've noticed so far. Is they just I haven't even used the other weapons. It's just like, yep, hyperbomb's the one. Dance the one. Don't need any other weapon, just hyperbomb it. Uh, 
flash bomb, electric, metal, air, fire, ice. Alright. Bring the thunder beam, I did. So. He's happy that Mega Man is doing what is necessary to promote peace, which is murder. If I learned anything from Mega Man, Dr. Light is really the true villain. I mean, he turned- he howled out a little boy and turned him into a robot. like a smaller version of the robot. Yes. <laughs> the the joke the joke that that comes from Steel Shin is the the Djibouti dub of uh of the Ruby Sparks Mega Man. Where he's like, I, I hollered out a little boy and turned him into a robot so he can be my own little Pinocchio. <laughs> and he he was talking about Proto Man. Uh, I knew I would get hit by that, but I let it happen. So the trick to this one is you just ignore everything you see and just do this. Oh dear lord, they brought these things back? I need to mentally prepare myself for these plant forms. Because they do that. They... they... do... that. So luckily we have the magnet beam, so I don't have to put up with that crap. We're just gonna run, we're gonna run, we're gonna get hit, we're gonna run. I can't... Well, I, I kinda can. Slow down. I was gonna say, I can't really cheese this part, cause it's... Oh, I almost did. little buggy thing try to kill me. Alright, oh, what's down here? There is nothing down here but Yoku blocks and death. So what do we do here? Well, we're gonna equip this and we're gonna ride that thing. And my hope is, uh, I don't die. Which mission accomplished, I didn't die. I might die here, if that's gonna happen. What the hell is this thing? What? What the fuck? Boing. Boing. Oh. I'm scared. But the slowdown is really saving my life here. Uh. Let me. Let me grow beard and think about it.
Yeah, he might kill me. I'm scared. I did it. They only give these guys like two patterns? This seems really underwhelming. But then again, uh, I think the Game Boy one only gave them two patterns, but they did it like really, really fast. While this one has, like, the slowdown is making it extremely easy and giving me a very hardcore advantage. Group no oh, man. thing in Mega Man. Fight feelings and death. Question mark tank. It could be anything. It could even be a boat. Ow. It was nothing. It was useless. Eddie gave better things than that. Piece of crap. Grab it, it's in the wall. I don't think I, yeah, no, I don't. I don't have the thing to deal with those guys. I got this. I don't got this. Hang on. I still don't got this. Wait, there's a ladder up here? Why does this go? <sighs> Gee, thanks. It's what I always wanted, more health. Wanted more health. All right, come on. 
Shop down so Danny can go get this heat tank and then run all the way back to deal with those guys. Yeah, well, I'll take the iframes for that. Oh, I didn't even see that guy. I was kind of hoping for the boat as well. Bears and out, but... Alright, we're gonna find out what's up here, cause... seem to take a lot of damage either. Oh my god, it's a giant testicle. And it's blowing everything down. I can't reach that high because I'm not in an uh, appropriate angle. Okay, well, yeah, that guy wasn't too hard either. My god. Playing Mega Man every day seems to have really significantly jumped my skill in Mega Man. That I am not phased by death. And I'm like three-fourths of the way there. Good luck, Mega Man. Welcome to the Fantasy Zone. on the ladder. You know, these guys were such a pain in the ass in the other game. Oh. Specifically the fourth game. Thanks, bruh. higher so he can't hit me with his dangly sperm all right hang on I need to think about this There's the biscuit Cheating. 
I'm cheating. It wasn't a really good magnet beam shot, but I'll take it. Boy, this is a room. get like that. See how it's like in the middle. I could never never get the squeeze spot like that. jumped into that. The world will never know why I did what I did. I want to know what's down there, but at the same time, I don't really think I care too much. She's a god. I've hit maximum lives. I actually forgot about those Pogo Spring dudes. Give me now. Oh shit, it's the monkey again, and my thing is filling very slowly. Oh shit, the floor is moving? I ran out of, uh... Whatever the hell I'm supposed to. Oh, this is bullshit. Why won't you get the fuck off the platform?
Ugh. No, you bastard! This is it. This is where I die. <laughs> this guy's gonna kick my ass, cause he... He found my weakness. How did he know that falling platforms was my weakness? This guy even waits till like the last second to do his attack. Ugh. Hey, I'm kind of surprised I made that jump, to be honest. I win! Holy shit! Yeah, this stage, uh... Alright. This stage... Yeah, it was a toughie. Especially with the slowdown. The slowdown made me even harder. <laughs> Because, like, I thought I was going to die a couple times. Aww. I have plenty of lives. So, whatever they're gonna throw at me, they better throw it pretty damn hard. That's a good dart. Oh, where's the metal blades? Am I gonna fight you, Proto Man? No, you're going to lead me astray. Wow, that was fast. I'm already here. What the shit? What the fuck is this? It's not the way. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. <laughs> uh...
fucking giant robot fight, I guess. Hey, I need a damn block, asshole. Fuck, he's gonna duke it out with me, fuck. What is this? Is this Rocket Knight Adventure? Cause he, this fucking robot reminds me of it. Yeah. Shit. I have to try this. Ow. Oh, that did a lot of damage. Duke it out, bitch. Let's go. Oh god, that hurt. What the hell does that do? It. Are you kidding me? They can't be it. He did one move. Damn. What is this, Gunstar Heroes? He threw the bomb at me. Was I supposed to pick that up? Oh, nice. Look, we got it done. I have completed live orders, apparently. The tower was not as hard as I thought it would be. Aside from the monkey fight, the second monkey fight was pretty hard. <laughs> Having to deal with the falling platforms. Dr. Stonebone. I wonder if I have his emote. I probably don't have Stonebone's emote. I'm sad. I'm gonna have to resub to him. Because Stonebone has a, uh, he has a Dr. Wily emote where it's just him doing the eyebrow raising. Now we get to do this. I'll let the ending play out and then I'm gonna move on to the next Mega Man's. But this time it's gonna be the Legacy Collection, because I haven't played the NES ones yet. So I might as well just keep fucking going with those. the eyebrows? They changed the thing too so it doesn't look like it's his feet. Alright, 
let me take a moment here. 